in the heart of a lush African village. There lived a young woman named Adana. Known for her unmatched kindness and unwavering loyalty, Adana had three closest friends. Ayana, the skilled weaver, Zuri, the graceful dancer, and Nia, the gifted healer. Together, they formed an inseparable bond, promising to stand by each other through thick and thin. One fateful day, as the village prepared for its annual celebration, Adana stumbled upon a magnificent lotus flower blooming by the tranquil river bank. Mesmerized by its beauty, she plucked the flower and carried it with her, envisioning it as a precious gift for her friends. Excitedly, Adana rushed to her friends' homes, eager to share her discovery. But to her dismay, Ayana, Zuri, and Nia were preoccupied with their own tasks, dismissing Adana's excitement with indifference. Heartbroken by her friend's rejection, Adana retreated to the river bank, seeking solace amidst the serene waters. As she gazed at the lotus, a gentle voice spoke to her, Adana, do not despair. True friendship is not measured by grand gestures, but by the sincerity of the heart. Determined to prove her worth, Adana embarked on a journey of self-discovery. Honing her skills in the art of healing and nurturing the land around her. With each passing day, she cultivated a garden of vibrant flowers, including the majestic lotus, which flourished under her tender care. Meanwhile, jealousy brewed with Ayana, Zuri, and Nia, as they witnessed Adana's newfound purpose and popularity among the villagers. Consumed by envy, they plotted to sabotage her garden, hoping to tarnish her reputation and regain their former glory. One moonlit night, as Adana slept soundly in her humble abode, her treacherous friends crept into her garden, intent on destroying her prized possessions. But to their astonishment, the flowers rose to her defense, weaving intricate patterns of thorns and vines. Awakened by the commotion, Adana rushed to her garden, where she found Ayana, Zuri, and Nia entangled in the vines. Remorse etched upon their faces, with tears in her eyes. Adana forgave her friends, realizing that their betrayal stemmed from their own insecurities. United once more, the four women vowed to cherish their bond, nurturing it like the delicate petals of a lotus flower. And as the village rejoiced in their reconciliation, Adana emerged as a beacon of hope and resilience. Her friendship with Ayana, Zuri, and Nia standing the test of time, like the enduring beauty of the lotus. And so, the tale of the lotus maiden echoed through the generations, a testament to the power of forgiveness, friendship, and the unwavering strength found within the human spirit. <laughs>